Okay. So we'll do it this way. Welcome home. And I say home because this is your tribe. And I've used that phrase many times, but this is your tribe. Welcome to BST Can. Oh, sorry, sorry. I should be doing this. Welcome to BST Can 2019. Yes, it's 16 years since I was unemployed and had nothing better to do than start, than start a BST conference. Many of you paid your own way here, and that says a lot because another conference I've gotten, most people don't pay their own way here, their employers send them here. And that indicates what a strong passion you folks have about being here. Now, the rest of you whose employers paid you here, you probably can't believe that your employer pays you to come here. <laughs> and they actually pay you to do stuff that's fun. So, about this session. We're going to go through the sponsors, a few points of order, because there's a lot of you that, that, that a lot of you, this is your first time here, despite having attended the newcomer's session last night. Who went to the newcomer's session last night? Okay, good. Um, there are some things that I'm going to go over here that aren't in there. There is no keynote this year. I'm your keynote. And then we'll go on to the talks. No keynote? Okay. So, this is a graph by column that should be automated if I've done it right. If I haven't done it right, I'll do it soon. We'll do this. This is a select star from person where date added is within a range. So this is the date that you registered. So this is a cumulative total of the number of people that are registered. And this year we took a 25% hit over last year. So last year we were at 280, which was a tying record. And this year we're about 210. Why did we drop? Well, we, I, I can't say for sure, but I can tell you what, what's different. One, we changed from June to May, and this weekend is a long weekend in Canada. Sorry about that. Uh, Monday is Victoria Day, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, sorry? Patriots Day. In Quebec. <laughs> Monday's a holiday in Canada. And it's eating into your long weekend. So, basically, it's not a big deviation from all the other previous years, because this is 2014, and we're about 125 people. So we basically doubled over the years. Did registration open a lot later? Yes, it did. Someone else mentioned that as well. You know, registration can open here, but this year we only opened way over there. So yeah, there are a lot of variables. So I can't really tell you which one it was, but I'm guessing. So a nice automatic graph, automated graph. So now, sponsors. First year, had no sponsors like I have sponsors now. I did have sponsors, but we couldn't do things in the first year that we can do now. In the first year, we all went out for lunch at the pub, and we did that for several years until, until we got to the level where we could afford to bring food in. But sponsors like VeriSign, Tarsnap, and the Food BC Foundation Help that happen. That's where you're supposed to apply. So I'm not actually authorized to, to have this on the website yet, but they are sponsoring. But we have that company and NetApp. Thank you very much. Yesterday, uh, no, earlier in the week, someone said they're always amused at how this name is pronounced, not the first one, the second one, but it, uh, oh, NetBSC Foundation, Nets Kuluna, thank you, and IX Systems, sorry it's very dark here, but IX Systems and, and Nets Kuluna and NetBSC are sponsors, thank you. First time here this year, Avolix. Uh, Scale Engine has been around uh, as a sponsor for a very long time, and NetFlex are helping out again. Thank you. <laughs> a side note, my favorite story for telling people what free BSD is about, or BSD in general, I tell them that if you ever watch Netflix, while you're picking your movie, you're on Amazon Web Services, as soon as you hit play, it's coming from free 
FreeBSD box, and every single thing comes from a FreeBSD box. Um, Stefan is, is the sponsor this year, six feet up. Genoa? Genoa. Is that pronounced correctly, I hope? Genoa. Okay, thank you. And <laughs> CIS5, thank you. Um, points of order aren't very complicated, but I just like using that phrase because it sounds official and stuff like that. So, lunch is at 12.15. Grab it and then go to a boff. What's a boff? Birds of a feather. It's an old uh, Usenix term. Usenix? Can the great beards compute? Confirm yeah, that? it wasn't Usenix. Yeah, it wasn't Usenix before yeah. Usenix? Yeah. All right, so basically, it's a bunch of people that are interested in a given topic, and you all sit around and talk about that topic. There's nothing structured. Just check the schedule and go into the box. Uh, there'll be snacks uh, at 2.30 after lunch. So there'll be lunch, the first afternoon session, and then there'll be snacks. Doc sprints tonight. If you've ever wanted to contribute to documentation, show up at 11.20, DMS 11.20 from 6 p.m. Hacker Lounge is open tonight till very late. Just leave it clean. Uh, it's in Lounge 140, which is over in the residences. Sorry over there. Um, tomorrow, we start from about 9.23 exactly, with snacks and stuff out in the lobby again like this morning. Um, but there's no opening session. We start at 10 tomorrow morning. You mean as opposed to Henderson? Is that, is that what you mean? Uh, yeah, that, that, not starting until 10. What? Not starting, not starting until 10. Until 10. No, right. I'll do all the way up okay. to Henderson. Yeah. I'm with you. So last year we couldn't get Alan 140 for the land, which is basically a room that holds about 100 people and tables and has Wi-Fi. Everyone sits around there and talks or works on stuff. So it's a very social event and it's very open and welcoming. Just walk in and sit down. Bring the extension board if you can, but there's lots in there already. Uh, we've covered basically all of that, and it'll be tonight and tomorrow night, and it, it will be popular. If you don't want your tote bag, someone hold up a tote bag so that someone, yeah. If you don't want these, bring them back to the registration desk. We will give them to the auto emission. Uh, if you don't want your badge holder and your lanyard, give it back to me, and it'll go to a summer camp for kids. That's about it. I already said that. But, okay. Closing session. Remember your credit cards, stuff like that, because if you don't, we'll auction them up. <laughs> it started many years ago. Somebody, uh, there was swag left over from one of the sponsors, and they said, well, do you want to auction this off? And so we started auctioning it off. And now the, the charity auction during the closing session is an annual event, and we Last year, we sold a $20 bill for $25, and I believe that $20 bill has come back. That same $20 bill is back again to be auctioned this year. We've, au we've auctioned off a, a non-functioning pen. It's we also back. It's <laughs> we've auctioned off an empty paper bag. People will buy anything. All right. We have a closing social event. If you've not signed up for the closing social event, visit the registration desk, it's 50 bucks. Now, at registration, how many of you get stars on your badge? Keep your hands up. Now, lower your hand if you don't know what that star is for. Okay, it gets you into the social event. Okay, so if you don't have a little star, you're not signed up for the social event, you can buy a little gold star or whatever color you want, actually at the registration desk, and that'll get you in. Yeah. All right. But Main I want, I want a star, so I'm This is different from the previous year. It's a different location. It used to be in Lower Town Brewery, but now it's up above it in uh, Sen's house. Uh, there's not going to be any music. There's not going to be going to be able to talk to each other. <laughs> Lots of food. Bring your badge, because you need your star. Uh, I don't know how that got up there. But yeah, okay. Your first two drinks, alcoholic, are on us, and non-alcoholic drinks are free all night. Um, there was one other thing. Dress warmly. Some of the seating will be outside in the patio covered, but it is, it is very nice. This is very important. Not Michael himself. 
but basically giving feedback. So if you go to a session, including this one, go to the schedule and click on this link and give feedback. That helps both the program committee and the speaker to know what you think about what they said. Question. Do you anonymize the feedback before passing it to the speaker? Yes. Okay. Nobody knows who said what. There's no login, no nothing. It's just a link. Yes, Ron? You are going to say something? All right. Any questions? But they're allowed to guess. <laughs> <laughs> Any questions whatsoever? Because we got 20 minutes. If we're going to wait 20 minutes, why did you wake us up 20 minutes early? Because <laughs> yeah, I thought there'd be more questions. <laughs> Actually, there's a gap between this and the next talk, so the people can get there and the speakers can get set up without rushing and sort of start on time. Did anyone promise me an LTO5 tape library? Did anyone bring it with them in their baggage? Because I can. I have one if you want to come and get it. Does it work? It worked when it was pulled a few years ago. Yeah, the problem is I have to take it down on my, on my flight. So it's not something you can take on a flight. I don't think so. I know, I know. <laughs> I have an LTO for. Right. I'm tempted just to go to an LTO, just to a tape drive instead it's, of a library. It's like about 100 kilo. Yeah, my plan isn't so cunning anymore, is it? <laughs> <laughs> so, if there are no questions, no ideas or suggestions or anything, nothing? suggestion for yes rather on the personal end of things yeah. IBM makes a really nice one U LTO auto loader yeah and it's pretty cheap too yep yeah. LTO what uh, you can get it in four five six or someday seven yeah I'm hoping someone doesn't love one anymore and gives it to me so that <laughs> I can love it for them <laughs> so if no more questions on to the talks have a good day thank you